Dear people of God, I'd like to wish you again, once again, we are in the Christmas season. Blessed Christmas to one and all and to your families. Some of you may be thinking I'm leaving this country and going somewhere else far, far away. But actually, I'm going down the road only. And I'm here as a friar to serve you whenever I am called to. I had many experiences of people who showed their love and care for me. I had one person who held my hands and remained silent, only tears welling up in her eyes. And I know how much she appreciated my presence and my ministry here as a friar priest. Then I had the 1 p.m. Filipino choir that sang together in unison this wonderful blessing of St. Francis taken from number six. And I felt touched. And so far as I have served my ministry as a priest, I'm always blessed to have God's gift, His people, to show their love, their care and appreciation. And therefore, I'm, I always feel proud to serve God's people and be called as a priest. I'd like to give credit to this particular friar, Friar Michael de Cruz, who as a parish priest called me to join the team from 2020 to 2022. I find him a man who is filled with a lot of passion, who has a heart for the people of St. Mary of the Angels. What was very inspiring about him is he went out of the way to uplift the people, especially when we were in the pandemic times. There were so many decisions to be made and we sat around as a team together with our service team. We came up with plans as to how to keep the faith alive in St. Mary of the Angels and to help people return back to God and to worship in the sacred space. Friar Mike tends to do things in a different way, but I feel deep in my heart he wants to make this place of St. Mary of the Angels a welcoming place and a place fit for our God, the King of all kings. And I pray that as both Friar Esmond and myself will be moving on to our next assignment as Friars, I pray that you as the people of God will support Friar Mike and the new team of Friars who are coming on board. I always believe that when we have the people on our side as Friars, you can bring the best out in each one of us to help you to connect with this God and to be united as one people of God. I had the slogan when I was in Kuching, behind every successful parish priest and his team is his people. And we need your support. We need your love. We need your prayers as we move forward. As we want to serve you, we desire to help you to draw closer to God and we want to celebrate as a people of God. I'd like to also thank people who have worked behind the scenes. They are quiet. They do not shout out loud. These are the very people that have built up this parish. And today, as we are in this endemic time, I'd like to invite you to come forward. Come and celebrate together as a people of God with this wonderful new team that is coming on board support us and I believe we'll make this new term that's coming a wonderful experience for all of us. God bless you for your love, your care, your peace and your joy. Greetings of peace, dear sisters and brothers, to all of you. As they say, all good things must come to an end and therefore I would like to take this opportunity before my next posting to thank each and every one of you for over the last years here at St. Mary's, it has indeed been a wonderful and memorable experience to be able to serve all of you. I would like to thank everyone from those active in ministries and those that I may meet just on a Sunday for a few minutes. Each and every one of you has in fact made my time here a memorable one and a joyful one. Thank you for teaching in your own way, for guiding and reminding me of my vocation and my role as a friar 
to serve all of you here at St. Mary of the Angels. And if there were times I may have hurt you, I seek your pardon. I also pray that you continue to support our parish here because this is your home. This is our home here on earth. I also ask humbly for your prayers as I move to my next posting to continue to pray with me and for me that I may also be an effective and humble shepherd to where the Lord sends me. And so I wish each and every one of you well. And until we meet again, may God bless you and keep us always in His love. <laughs>